Yeah, I feel like this dish should be kind of gross, but it did kind of look good. When ordering boiled eggs in Singapore, you might be in for a surprise. The eggs don't harden as much as we're used to, yielding a rather soupy consistency. Yeah, I don't think I'd eat that, to be honest. I would definitely try it, yeah. Yeah, it looks really good. Yeah, I'd give it a try. I can't bash it until you try it. That's what I was saying when I was watching it. Yeah. It's a bit eggs. different to what we eat here. Maybe a little bit. Yeah, the a little. Texture. I mean, yeah, I feel like the texture would be kind of gross, but... It did kind of look good, and the, the, he was dipping into with the, the eggs with the toast. Would I would right. eat that, yeah, like dippy eggs. No, <laughs> no. I mean, food is food, and you can't really hate on it, you know. Like if it's edible, it's feastable. Um, I wouldn't say they're gross. I don't think they're mine necessarily cup of tea, but I wouldn't bash anyone else for eating them. I'm not really a soft white person. That's just textural for me. <laughs> like egg and soldiers. Egg and, yeah, egg and soldiers. That's where like you dip the bread into like a runny egg. And, but the egg is cooked, but you don't cook it all the way, so you can eat it like yeah. that. In a lot of movies, they like they drink the raw eggs for the protein and strength and everything. And I've heard of people even putting them in their coffee, like raw eggs in their coffee. Oh, no. People eat like fish eggs. Like, fish eggs, yeah. And famous. I've seen this other egg before where it's like half fertilized and they still eat it. So mm, yeah, that's yeah. that's more shocking, I feel. A little no. bit, a little, a little bit, maybe. <laughs> no, because I mean, every country has its own culture.